Welcome back to Crypto Warehouse. My name is Mike and today we are going to take a look at Venus, Venus Prime and everything associated with this algorithmic money making website. We're going to take you through the website. We're going to take you through the white paper. We're going to take you through the breaking news about Venus Prime. We're going to have a look at the token. We're going to go under the hood of the project, have a look at their socials, give you some price targets and finish with our conclusion on the project. And believe you me, you do not want to miss this one. Thanks to Peter, I think we have unearthed an absolute gem. Before we begin, however, can you please like and subscribe to Crypto Warehouse and help us grow the channel? So put down your meme coins, put down Bonk, put down Pepe. This is a serious project. And off the bat, I just want to say how impressed I am with the project. This is everything we want to see from DeFi in one website. So let's get into it. What is Venus? Venus is an algorithmic money maker protocol. And that's something that we're going to go through step by step. So first of all, let's go through the front page of the website. As you would expect from a money maker protocol, they have the usual suspects listed USDT, USDC, BNB, ETH and BTCB. This runs on Ethereum and BNB Smart Chain. BNB Smart Chain is important to realize that that is the chain that gives most people access to this platform. It's cheap and it's quick, unlike Ethereum. And as with all things decentralized, one of the key aspects of this is security. And as you can see here, audit upon audit has been completed by these several platforms. In fact, Venus is so secure, it came third highest on the BNB chain, as assessed by Certic in June 2021. This is also not a new coin. We're going to go through the history of it in the white paper in a minute. But this is not something that's come flying out the door. This has been around in the previous bull run. And once you log into Venus, you are presented with this beautiful dashboard that gives you full access to all of the coins available on their platform. You can even select buy stable coins, GameFi tokens, DeFi and even Tron. So you have a wide range of tokens available on the platform. In addition, you have isolated pools, really important for safety and security and liquidation issues. And being DeFi, there is governance involved as well. There have been over 300 improvements suggested and implemented by the teams. So this is something that's being built for the community by the community. And we will get on to the native token XVS later on in the video. Now we've had a quick look around the website, let's go through the white paper. It's a fairly extensive white paper, so I'm not going to go through every element of it. What I am going to do is leave links to the website, to the white paper, to the socials in the links below this video. Now, as we have said, Venus Protocol is an algorithmic based money market system designed to bring a complete decentralized finance based lending and credit system onto the BSC smart chain. Now, of all the problems Venus is trying to solve, this one for me is the most important. The current protocols are heavily centralized, such as Compound. Stakeholders and private equity funds control most of the decision making and do not have a variety of other control mechanisms. Their distribution plan does not equate to decentralization. Over $1 billion in ETH is locked up in MakerDAO that earn no value but come at a cost to those minting assets. So this is trying to solve several problems, but for me, the most important one is when you have companies such as Compound, they do become very centric and that causes issues when you're trying to build a decentralized platform. The clue is in the name. It was so obvious. Now their solution is to create a protocol that enables a traditional money market tied into synthetic stablecoin generation that will lead to accessibility and benefits of locked collateral. Venus will enable anyone to utilize the BSC chain, as mentioned, and earn interest on that collateral, borrow against that collateral, and mint stable coins on demand within seconds. These are all available through a beautiful UI, as we have seen. The protocol unlocks billions of dollars in value that are currently on chains that have no lending markets, such as Bitcoin, XRP, Litecoin, and more while enabling the participants to access liquidity in real time. And these four key features sum up Venus. You can borrow, you can supply, you can mint stable coins against your collateral. And the entire system is controlled by the Venus token, which is the governance token of the platform. 
That is how Venus has been working so successfully for the last three or four years. And now they are going to introduce Venus Prime. Venus Protocol is excited to announce Venus Prime, a revolutionary incentive program aimed to bolster user engagement and growth within the protocol. An integral part of Venus Tokenomics 3.1, Venus Prime aims to enhance rewards and promote XVS staking, focusing on markets including stables, Bitcoin and Ethereum. To take part in this, you will be given a non-transferable soulbound token. To get this, you will need to stake at least 1000 XVS for 90 days in a row. After 90 days, you will be able to mint this token. If a user decides to withdraw within that period of time, then you will have it revoked within your wallet. The limit to the number of revocable Prime tokens is 500 on the BNB chain. Now, it doesn't give you the date when this will be launched, but it does give you fair warning that this is going to happen. Now, there is somewhat of an issue with this that we're going to get onto at the end, and that is staking a minimum of 1,000 XVS tokens. As of the recording of this video, XVS is $10. So this requires you to stake $10,000 worth of XVS for 90 days on Venus. That is the downside for a project that is aiming to get in touch with the masses because the masses do not have $10,000 to stake for 90 days. However, let's not detract too much from the project. There are only 500 of these tokens available. So this is aimed at rewarding the OGs that were in Venus from maybe 2021, 2022. So before we have a look at Dex tools, let's go over to CoinGecko and have a look at the project. $10 is the price of the token right now giving it a market cap of just under $160 million. The fully diluted valuation is $300 million. The total supply is just under 30 million with the circulating supply 15.7. Please bear in mind if the circulating supply is only 55%, 60% of the total supply, there will be in the future deflation in the value of your tokens as more and more tokens are released. And as you would expect from a project of this nature and this size, it is listed on all major tier one exchanges, including Binance, including Mexi, and including Gate.io. So if you do want to buy the token, it is available on all major exchanges. Dex Tools is the place to go, however, if you want to delve a little further on tokens. The market cap is just under 160 million. There is $500,000 worth of liquidity an astonishing 75,000 holders of the project and the circulating supply is 53.45%. That's a worry for me with this token. The price action of Venus, as you would expect, is very good. It is appreciating in value over time. Towards the end of last year, it was just over $3.50 and as of the recording of this video, it at $10 with a max of $17.60 achieved in April before the correction and the correction in the markets. As a project that prides itself on audits, you can see it's passed Quick Intel, GoPlus and Honeypot.is on here with flying colors with only one alert. There is no Honeypot, there is no buy or sales tax and it is not tax modifiable. So the project looks good, the price action looks good, the tokenomics is a little bit of a worry but so far so good for me for the project. With regards to socials then, Venus is very active on both Telegram and on Discord and has over 230,000 followers on their X account, which again, I will leave all the links to in the description below. And most importantly, if you're going to do one thing, make sure you follow them on Twitter because that's where they're going to get all of their announcements out to you as a potential investor. 16 hours ago then, the announcement came that they'd had just passed $200 million in TVL on Ethereum, having only launched two months ago. And for me, being multi-chain is a big tick for Venus. BSC chain is a good project. Having Ethereum as well is a game changer. And more information down here about their expansion, they are going to start deployment on Arbitrum and a nice array of coins available across all of the Ethereum chains itself including stables, including wrapped Bitcoin. In conclusion then, what do I think of Venus? I think for a project I hadn't heard of until three days ago, 
this is an excellent project. It ticks many of the boxes that I have with regards to projects like this. It is well established. It has a roadmap. It's been building itself out. The white paper is clear and concise. The team behind it know what they're doing. They have a great history of governance from the community rather than from a centralized location. So they are building their project for the community with their community. So for me, I can't say anything other than this gets a big green tick from Crypto Warehouse. The only downside for me is the supply of tokens, which is less than 60% in circulation. That does mean there's going to be token inflation over time, and that is a bit of a worry for me. The second minor worry for me is the requirement is to stake $10,000 worth of tokens for 90 days to get one of the 500 gold bound NFTs. But again, that is meant to be exclusive for the OG. So I can understand why they've built it along those lines. Overall, however, everything about Venus is good. In terms of price action, then we're looking at a $150 million project in the bull run. When everything rises, I would expect Venus to go somewhere towards 50 to $100 in the bull run, if not higher. I'm not going to be overly optimistic on the price action of Venus because at $100 per token, we are looking at $1.5 billion market cap. So we have to temper our expectations of a lot of these projects. Not everything is going to rip in the bull run, but I do expect a 50 to $100 price target for Venus. With all that being said, thank you for watching to the end of our review of Venus. This was a brief overview. I will leave all of the links in the description below. And no, this is not a sponsored video. We have not been paid or sponsored by Venus to make this video. As always, you have been great. I have been Mike. Until the next video, goodbye.